I cannot believe I'm doing this. It's for my own master, Master Master Lee. That's all it is that I gotta do. But that's always. But not always that stuff. But great in name of the great legion is this double phonetic descendant. Oh so master master. Hey, hey, I know, I know, I know. It was funny about your montage name. The Godzilla Dick Daddy. <laughs> I know! I know, I know, Master, I know, I know. I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe I'm doing this. What? No, I'm every girl that is hot in this summer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everything I know about that. Everything I know about that, okay? Let's just begin. Study the new game. Am I just every girl? Let it out. Group. Ashley, Zoe, Sarah, Abai. Why? 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 Like no other thing. What go that? The white. Man, I don't know how oh my god to do this. But according to legends passed down from ages long past. Okay. An era Maybe of darkness and now. destruction draws near. Deep within the endless sea of stars <laughs> stirs an ancient Good evil thing. forgotten Subscribe by time. I'm not gonna do any more videos. Trust me, I'm The Nymphogen. Well, like, Spirits of limitless lechery lying dormant in the cosmos. Awoken only once every 10,000 years. By a cosmic super period of unspeakable PMS. With symptoms so severe and desires so destructive, entire galaxies have been consumed by the chaos. It is said that only a hero of unparalleled prowess can overcome the insatiable <laughs> lust of the demonic pair Prowess. and return them peacefully to a satisfied slumber. As the dreaded day looms upon an unsuspecting world, no such savior has risen to stand against the threat, and Earth is left defenseless against certain doom. Wait, woman in here? actually, I might know somebody. Your apartment on a Tuesday night. Okay. Uh, 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 oh, excuse uh, me. I can't do it. Uh, That's so what? refreshing. Thanks, man. <laughs> I really needed that. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I bet you are, you animal. <sighs> Listen, I'd love to stick around and watch your dick shrink, but what? I got a split. I have a crazy early flight tomorrow. My boss is sending me out to some island for an exotic shoot. Then I'm supposed to meet up with this teleuber chick for a cross promo we've been planning. <sighs> it's not easy being a world class fashion model, you know? <laughs> <clears throat> Fun voyage. Right now, the missing piece is not. Leave the fence. I can't. Oh, yeah. I can't oh, yeah. help you there, Perv. I borrowed this lingerie from the company. 
I'm pretty sure they need it back. They haven't even released this line yet. Now, where did you throw my clothes? Ah, there they are. Well, aren't you at least gonna walk me back to my car? Oh god, forget you man, last time I ask you for anything. Later sweet cheeks, keep oh. that thing nice and hard for me for when I get back. Alright then. Well, what well, well, you? look at this motherfucker. I leave you alone for a year or two and you're banging models on the reg? I really am a miracle worker. What? You think you're my only client? Tch. There's a lot of virgins out there. None of them picked it up quite as fast as you, though. <laughs> That's actually kind of why I'm here. Look, I'm gonna cut right to the chase because time isn't exactly on our side here. Some seriously crazy shit is about to pop off and we need your help to stop it. Oh, okay. Bitch, you owe me big time for all Whoa. that succulent snatch you've been enjoying. Uh, I Don't excuse forget, me. I, am I a made baby you boy. and I can I'm, unmake I'm you. 19. So shut up and listen. To make a long story <laughs> short, there are these two, like, evil space hookers that are about to be awoken. And if they don't get some wicked good dick, they're probably hey, gonna destroy I am the galaxy. A man. And that would really suck because Earth has some of the finest babes in the universe, next to Tendricide. You see, part of my job as a love fairy is to find a worthy hero among all the pathetic virgins. Why, Unfortunately, nobody? we couldn't find one, so you'll have to do instead. Oh. So really done. I mean, how hard could it be? I've nailed the space check before. I strongly advise you not to underestimate just how horny these semen demons can be. I don't know wish to be horny I'll anymore. I'll be honest with you, man. The higher-ups are concerned about your lack of experience with threesomes. But I told him you're a quick learner. Oh. Besides, you did bag the fucking goddess of love. That's gotta count for something, right? So, put on some goddamn underwear and pack your bags. Our flight leaves first thing in the morning. Now that's what I like to hear! If only everybody would blindly do what I say without asking questions. Can you believe it, man? The old team, back together again for another sexy adventure! I can't believe you humans have to get into big machines just to do something as simple as flying. I hate to say it, but if it wasn't for all the honey you guys generate, you'd be pretty useless. I appreciate the confidence, but don't overestimate yourself, alright? What we're asking you to pork here is unlike anything you've ever porked before. Uh, speaking of which, I should probably fill you in on the plan, huh? We are headed to the beautiful tropical island of Ina de Puna. Why, you may ask? Shh! You see, the Nymphogen, those are the space hookers, are on the verge of being awoken by their period. If that happens, you can kiss your sorry ass goodbye. So, we need to wake them up before that. There's a volcano on the island called Mount Nymphojaro. Yeah, I don't know who names this shit. If we can get that volcano to erupt, it should be enough to awaken the Nymphogen early. 
But the only way to get that bitch to blow is to offer a sacrifice. A sacrifice of fairy wings. I'm sure you're wondering, what the hell are fairy wings? I thought I told you to stop asking questions. You ever hear the phrase, whenever a threesome is had, a love fairy gets her wings? Yeah, well, that's actually true. So we need to get you mixed up in some menage a trois. As much as I'd fucking love to be more involved, unfortunately, love fairies don't count. Besides, corporate said I have to stop fucking my clients. Can you believe that shit? <sighs> now look, locking down a three-way can be tricky. The best way to do it is by going on double dates the lame kind of double date where it's two couples. The cool kind where it's you and two chicks. You'll need some fresh love fairy tech though. That crusty ass honeybee 4.0 is way out of date. So, da 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 da! Introducing the brand new Honeybee 6XL with threesome compatibility detection package. Go ahead, check it out. When you're done, you can close it by clicking anywhere off the honeybee. You can also open and close the honeybee with a simple middle click or tap of the space bar. So, uh, yeah! I think that's pretty much my entire spiel. Well, for now, at least. Any questions? It's some bullshit new rule they have. Uh, I know. If you're disappointed, imagine how I feel. I thought I heard a familiar voice back here. Hey, stranger. Long time no see. No way. Isn't she that tight-ass flight attendant you used to bang? Oh, man. Can I book a flight or what? Small world, huh? I never thought I'd bump into you on one of my routes. By the way, uh, who were you talking to? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm invisible. You must look like a crazy person back here. You should probably change the subject before it gets any more awkward. Yep, still here. I did have to reduce my hours though so I could focus on other things. Believe it or not, I started my own little fashion design business. I have a website and everything. It's still young, though, so I don't want to quit my day job just yet. Enough about me, though. Let's talk about you. What brings you out to Ina de Puna? You too, huh? I'm actually going to be enjoying a little time off on the island myself. I'm meeting up with an old friend of mine for a little vacay we've been planning forever. So... You want to join the Mile High Club? What? I work hard. A girl's got to find some way to relieve a little stress, right? I'm going to pretend I have to go to the bathroom, but I'll leave the door unlocked. Wait a couple minutes so you don't raise any suspicion, okay? Bro, we haven't even landed yet and you're already scoring ass? Maybe this chick isn't as uptight as I thought. This is actually a great opportunity for me to teach you about double dates. What do you say? All right! Well, let's head in there. We don't want to keep her waiting, do we? I've been so busy working, I don't even know how long it's been since I've gotten any. Alright, I'll try to make this quick, because I know we all just want to get to the good part. You remember how dates work, right? Well, double dates are... The goal is still the same. You want to fill up the affection meter before you run out of moves. You do that by matching three or more of these tokens, either horizontally or vertically. Well, affection tokens to be exact. Affection tokens are the circular ones with symbols on them. Like those three flirtation tokens over there. 
go ahead and match those. You know, the green ones in the middle of the grid there, with the stars on them. Now, the biggest difference with double dates is, obviously, that there's two chicks. You gotta learn how to divide your time and attention between both girls. Right now, you're focused on me. To switch over to her, all you gotta do is click on her. Easy sleazy! Now that you're focused on her, all the matches you perform will go to her. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to find some talent tokens for you to match. Oh, in the bottom left-hand corner, the blue ones with the music notes on them. Of course, bigger matches, such as four or more in a row, will also give you more affection. Switch focus back over to me and I'll show you. You can use right-click as a shortcut. Try it. There's a four-of-a-kind romance token match somewhere on the grid. I'll let you find it. In case you forgot, romance tokens are the orange ones with the crescent shapes on them. bigger matches that you gotta watch out for is that they also cost more stamina. My stamina is looking pretty low right now, so let's find some stamina tokens to match. There, in the top right corner of the grid, match those stamina tokens. The want to happen is for a girl to run out of stamina. If that happens, she'll be completely exhausted until her stamina fully recovers. I'm sure you remember the other token types, but I'll give you a quick refresher just in case. The gold bells are called joy tokens. They give you extra moves. You can't beat that. The pink hearts are called passion tokens. Matching those... The higher her passion is, the more affection she'll give from affection token matches. Broken hearts work a bit differently on double dates, but you still want to avoid them at all costs. Matching broken hearts will instantly drain a girl's stamina and put her in a bad mood. That's not even the worst part of it either. You want to know the worst part? If both girls are angry or exhausted, you're done. Yup, you failed. The date's over. So don't do that, okay? 
Okay. Is that everything? Can I shut up now? No, wait! Date gifts! Duh! How do I always forget about date gifts? I'm sure you didn't pack any, so... I got you covered! Switch focus back over to her, will ya? Here. She might like this one. It's from Honey Corp's newest line of date plushies. As usual, she'll need some sentiment before you're able to give her the date gift. I'll let you find a good sentiment token match. You're looking for the teal-colored teardrops. Perfect! That should be... There you go! Honey Corp has tons of new and classic date gifts for... And... That's it! Well, those are most of the basics of double dating anyway. I know it's a lot to take in, but don't worry. You'll get the hang of it. Now finish up this date so we can do what we came here to do. Or rather, who we came here to do. <laughs> I'll make sure you can't fail this one. Just try not to screw it up too bad, okay? Still got it! up a bit of a sweat here. Oh, You're right. lucky this is back in the game. tutorial date. to match the broken heart.
Well, are we just gonna sit and catch up or are you gonna take that thing out? All right, now it's time for the ahem, bonus round. This is the part where you fug the girls. Unfortunately, I have to sit this one out or I'll have to go through abstinence training again. But the bonus round is pretty simple. Just forget everything I just taught you about double dates and match tokens as fast as you can. It doesn't matter which ones, just keep matching. Try not to stop or slow down. Getting two girls to climax simultaneously requires some serious sexterity. Way too loud. Fuck, I was trying to keep it down. Great work! I couldn't have boned her better myself. Well, maybe a little better. Well, that was certainly refreshing. <laughs> Hopefully, nobody saw us walk out together. Oh. I saw a lot more than that. Perfect timing, too. Looks like we're about to begin our descent. I better go take my seat. You still have my number, right? Give me a ring so we can meet up on the island. Mwah. By the way, you're probably wondering why a bunch of fruit popped out of us after the date, huh? Well, out here in the... There we go. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus Christ, okay. <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> oh my god. I need to put up this. Yes. This. I need to put up this. This is how I need this stuff. I need to put up this. That's all I can do. Just now. I'm gonna put up this. So, so that sees what's coming. So with that sees what's coming. No, no, that's the whole point. All right, all right, buddy. Okay. The tropics, honey takes Jesus. a slightly okay. different form than you're used to. Instead of that weird pink jelly stuff, it manifests as what we call honey seeds. Don't worry, you can still use uh, them to buy gifts and other useful point. items no, from the honey. Bee. Oh, look, there it is. I can see the island. We're almost there. Mmm, mmm, mmm! I can practically taste all that delicious clam already! Good thing. Ah, uh, Inadip. Inadip Kuna. What? That's literally the slogan for the island. It's right there on the sign behind you. Also, no. What the fuck is uh. that? Hey, look over there. Isn't that your little sex buddy from home? How convenient is uh -oh. that? Um, dude, stalk much? <laughs> what in the fuck are you doing here? Just 
couldn't stand to be without me, huh? Well, who could blame you? Dude, if you wanted to fly out here with me, all you had to do was ask. If I'd have known you were coming, I wouldn't have had to explain my vibrator to security. Oh, oh. my god. I love her. You already have an in with this chick, too. Now all we gotta do is convince her to have a three-way. Did you fly all the way out here to ask me that? Course I'm down for a three-way. You better find us a oh, hot girl, boy. though. I only sit a sevens and up. Bro, where did you find this chick? I want one. I have some business stuff to take care of out here, but I should have plenty of free time, too. I'm staying at... What was the name? Oh, yeah. Lovely. Lovely Hotel. What a coincidence. That's exactly where we'll be staying, too. Anyway, I should probably go find my luggage. Catch you later, sweet cheeks. Well, that's oh, man. Fitting. I am definitely sneaking into her room at night to get a whiff of that. Speaking of which, we should go check in before it gets too late. Come on, let's go. Okay. Pretty sweet digs, huh? If yes, you're gonna try is. to save the galaxy, you might as well do it in style. Good evening. Hello? Welcome to Lovely Hotel. My name is Lailani. How may Lailani. I be of service? Yes, Lailani. I can think of a few ways this cutie pie could be of service to me. <laughs> Oh, you are? Okay, uh, perhaps I need to double check. But I don't remember seeing any more reservations in the system for tonight. Shit! I knew I forgot to do something. Uh, not a problem, though. I'm sure we can find the appropriate accommodations for you. What kind of room were you looking for? Hmm. Let's see what we have for you. I know everything on the first floor is taken. But I do have a great room for you on the second floor. It has a nice view and a big bed. Ooh. I think you'll find it to be quite suitable. Excuse me briefly while I retrieve your key card. Ooh. Okay, you're all set. Here's your key card. The room number is written on the back. If you need anything else, please don't hesitate to ask. That's what we're here for. Okay. The elevator is behind you to your right. Enjoy your stay and have a wonderful night. Okay. okay. Morning, sunshine. I hope you slept well, because we've got a full day of double dates ahead of us. You remember how the honeybee registers the girls you meet and tracks their location, right? Well, now it can also detect the presence of girls that you haven't even met yet. Just open up the Girl Finder app and select a location where two girls are going to be. The honeybee will automatically detect if the girls are compatible with each other. If they are, you can probably coax them into a threesome. But it might take a date or two. Oh, yeah. All right! I'm psyched! You psyched? Yeah, you're psyched! Let's go get you laid! Oh, and if you ever need to check in with me, just meet me back here at the hotel room. Okay! That's all I know about that. Hey, I'm glad you're here. This is perfect. You know that famous Teleuba chick I mentioned? Well, I'm meeting her here any minute now to plan our collab video. It just so happens we're gonna need a camera guy. So, make yourself useful, will ya? Think of it as an opportunity to pay me back for everything I do for you. Or everything I let you do to me, to be exact. It's only for adults, and it's 18. Oh my gosh, Ashley! I can't believe we finally get to meet in person! Well, if it isn't Polly Bendelson herself, it's great to meet you, girlfriend. 
This is so exciting. I've wanted to collab with you ever since I first saw your quickie pick page. Believe me, the feeling is mutual. It's a huge opportunity for us both. By the way, I'd like you to meet my friend here. He's my new camera guy. Oh my, what a handsome young man. <laughs> I'm Polly. Delighted to make your acquaintance. Hi, Polly. <gasps> and here I thought all the charming gentlemen were gone. Ah, shit. You know what? I forgot my tripod. Hold on, I'll be right back. Two minutes tops. Well, take your time, girl. It's a chance for me to get to know your cute friend better. <laughs> huh. That's weird. How come the honeybee isn't registering this chick? No, wait. There it goes. Huh. That's never happened before. No, wait. Here it Must goes. be a bug or something. You were saying... Anyway, I'm getting a traditional vibe from this broad. She's probably looking for a classy guy. So try to wait... At least 10 fucking seconds before you whip your dick out. Can you do that? Okay. Whoop the dick! <laughs> yes, sir! It'll be almost four years now since I started making videos. I run a beauty channel called Polly's Paradise. You ever hear of it? You don't want to miss the new video with Ashley and I. Alright, got the tripod. Ready to go scouting for a good location? I sure am. Will your cute friend be joining us? Yup. We wouldn't want to be out there without a decent camera guy, would we? Ah. Is it up to me to kill the awkward silence again? Okay, let's see. Are you more of a tit man or an ass man? Uh... <laughs> if you say so. Don't be shy now. I'm at the gym first thing in the morning, working off the chocolates I ate Saturday night. Yep, I'm not surprised. We have pretty similar lifestyles after all. Ah, I, I was gonna lay around and do nothing, but I guess that can wait. Right, level two, courtyard, afternoon. Star, level two, let's go. Let's Who go. wants to play Marco Polo? Aha, this is all I knew! Bikini style! Alright, let's get it! Oh, right. 
I think we deserve a little better than that, don't you? It's such a peaceful day, isn't it? I don't think anything could disturb this tranquility. Konnichiwa! Oh, Genki Desuka! Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Sorry, I think I got it wrong. But I'm practicing, I promise! Wait, I've seen you around recently. You're the new assistant to Mrs. Bell Rose, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm! I'm Suki! Well, that's my Japanese name anyway. It's a pleasure to meet you, Suki. I'm Lailani. I work at the hotel. Occasionally the massage spa, too. <gasps> really? I work with a real Japanese girl? Oh, sugoi! Oh, no, I'm not... <laughs> You're tan, too, just like me! OMG! Do you also like Yaru fashion? N no, uh... No, I'm actually Paul... Have you been to Shibuya? Or Harajuku? Or Akihabara? What's it like? Will you take me there sometime? Uh... Well, I'd love to, but... I don't... I mean... I'm not... <sighs> I can't believe I'm actually best friends with a tan Japanese girl! <laughs> What's that smell? You smell that? It smells like... Like a fucking weeb! <laughs> Ugh, I have to put up with enough of this shit back home. Hey. You think anime is popular down here? You should see Sky Garden. Where do you think the designs for these Love Fairy uniforms came from? Rescue Hotel Girl before this dweeb makes her watch an entire season of some magical Chan girl shit. You know karate? Where'd you learn that? I learned that from my Wait, oh. you went to Japan, <laughs> didn't you? What was your favorite part? Oh, oh, like anime and manga and video games? Oh, and hentai too. Uh -huh. I'm so, 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 hey. so jealous. But, but, but I might be going there soon. 
I'm Mrs. Just... Belrose says she'll take <laughs> care if I behave myself and do a real good job. Um, that's all. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry about that. But... Well, uh... Yep, yep. I'm trying. I always do whatever she tells me to. Lailani! When I visit Japan, you'll show me all the best spots, right? Right? Uh, Suki, I don't live in Japan. Ah, it's gonna be super duper fun! Uh, I think <laughs> you don't have fun now, but that's a lot You know what I've been thinking about a lot lately? Have you ever had a lucid dream? Where you're aware that you're dreaming? Mind, it was probably rude of me to even ask. <laughs> oh, oh. Hey, hey, I have a question. Do you like chubby girls? Chubby girl. Is that really true? Are you trying to trick me? No. I hate to be a bother, but I'm curious about something. When you get really anxious or nervous, how do you calm yourself down? Wow! <laughs> I wish I could think more like that. Yeah. What? What? Huh? What is it? I like to go hiking when it's nice out, but I need somebody to carry me up the hard parts. Oh, that's neat! You and I have that in common! Sure! Come on, let's go! Come on, come on, come on! What is this the comfort in? What the action? But it's just the over indeed. Didn't have to be so rude or anything. It's so pretty oh. here. I rarely it's ever loving. get taken to places wow. as nice as this. That will be cat that love it. This is a joy. What? Take the fair share. Let's do it. Ah, ah there we go. Oh, oh, you go ahead. I don't want to slow you two down. Oh, right. I forgot. Uh, down there. What is this down there? Oh, the journey is down Girl being horny. I just wanted to be happy, and that's it.
exhausting. To me too. Yeah. Always does that. Apologies. Ah! You stupid dummy head! Oh no, I'm sorry. What? <laughs> Whoops! Uh, I think that was supposed to go the other way. Oh, double fill. Hey, um, excuse me, miss? Sorry, what's your name? Who? Me? Uh, Nora, can I help you with something? You cleaned my room earlier this morning, right? Uh, maybe, I don't know, I cleaned a lot of rooms this morning. Okay, well, some jewelry went missing from my room this morning. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? Nope, sorry. Oh. All right. It's just, I could have sworn it was on the nightstand before you came in. I don't know what to tell you, but I didn't take your shit if that's what you're suggesting. Oh, Who else hey, could have taken it? You were the only person, that's person that's in the room aside from me. Look, I'm sorry your shit went missing, but I don't appreciate being accused of shit I didn't do. Oh yeah, she definitely took it. Yep, that's one of the advantages of having fairy vision. I can see people with transparent clothing whenever I want. It's clearly in her left pocket. We're not here to solve crimes, though. We're here to sleep with two chicks at the same time. So you gotta de-escalate the situation and get these two to like each other. Hmm. I seriously doubt it, but I'll go double check just in case. Jesus, what the fuck is her problem? If you say so. Wait a sec. Aren't you the guy in room 216? Yo, what the fuck did you spill on your sheets this morning? Busted! <laughs> nah, I'm pretty sure that ain't toothpaste. It wasn't exactly minty fresh. I ain't mad. I'm just trying to figure out how the fuck you managed to do it. No luck. I double-checked everywhere and still couldn't find it. <sighs> Will you at least let me know if you happen to come across it? Yeah, for sure. If it turns off somewhere, I'll let you know. Yeah? I don't know what it's called, but that T-shirt with the little black balls in it? That shit's good. Ask away. I get a kick out of answering your questions. I like to find a cute cafe and enjoy a cup of coffee. You probably knew that, though. That's where we met. See? Now this chick knows what's up. You got something to say to me? Growing up with a bunch of brothers, you play a lot of sports. It's cool, though, because they always lost. Now this is a girl with high-quality taste. Oh, I just remembered something I was going to ask you. What's the most recent thing you've done for the very first time? <laughs> How did I know you were going to say something like that? Yeah, okay, sure. I mean, what's the worst thing that could happen? Strip club? Hold on. Wait. Careful now. One too many hey. drinks and I'll be the one up on that stage. Hey, <laughs> Excellent. Okay. Okay. 
I ain't complaining. shape or what? I knew I should have gotten coffee earlier. I guess I sort of like got a confession to make. I, uh, I did take your jewelry. I'm sorry, okay? I know it's fucked up. I just, cash is tight, you know? Okay. My cousin, she don't really make enough to support her kid, and like, she ain't got nobody else to help her. Hmm, you know what? Keep it. What? No, no, it ain't right. Here, you gotta take it back, please. Really, it's fine. I've got plenty of jewelry. It seems like you need it more than I do. Yo, I don't know what to say. Don't worry about it. Besides, I think there might be another way you can pay me back. Oh. Not too shabby. I can see you're definitely getting the hang of these double dates. It looks like the honeybee was able to determine that these two kind of have the hots for each other. But threesomes don't just happen, you know? You gotta be in the right place at the right time. Naturally, the honeybees got you covered there too. Just keep an eye on the Girl Finder app. It'll alert you when there's a perfect opportunity for a second date. You can't miss it. Is that handy or what? I swear, the guys at Honeycorp think of everything. Good night. Ugh, I just saw myself in the mirror. 
Is my ass really that fat? Gotta lay off the candy. Bro, why would you even ask me that? You haven't even had a single threesome yet. Okay, but fair warning, I'm probably gonna do weird stuff to you while you sleep. Good thing, though. Wakey, wakey, legs and cakey! Don't forget, there's plenty of complimentary lotion and tissues in the bathroom! Like, what the heck? I'm not too disturbing, but it will soon look that will be freaked out if I'm playing. Sweat dreams! Sweat dreams. I'll sweat dreams for you. Sweat dreams for you and your ass! I'd love to let you sleep in, but these muff mines ain't gonna excavate themselves. Lovely Hotel. My name is Lailani. Oh my god, aren't you just the cutest thing? <laughs> the thing though, oh my god. With the little I flower can... in your hair and everything, stop. I, I can love it. That's all I hear. <laughs> Me? <laughs> no, it's just part of the uniform. <laughs> I appreciate the compliment I... though. How may I be of service to you today? Just checking in, sweetheart. The last name is May. Excellent. Thank you, Mrs. May. Give me just one moment to pull up your reservation. Technically, it's just Miss, but please, call me Jessie. Yes, of course. My apologies, Miss Jessie. Stop it. Miss Jessie. <laughs> How <it>. fucking adorable <laughs> is that? Ugh, <laughs> uh, I can't stand it. <laughs> Okay, you're all checked in. Excuse me briefly while I retrieve your key card. Oh, no way! The porn milf is here too? Who knew all this classic cooch would be here just right for the sticking? Is it just me or is she even more naked than usual? It's hard to tell because most of the time I'm watching videos of her like 100% naked. Speaking of which, I've seen some stuff where she's with like seven or eight dudes. So, a threesome ought to be like a day off for her. Oh. <gasps> oh my god! Are you serious? Hi, it's so good to see you. What are you doing here? Ugh, tell me about it. It's so good to be able to get away from it all for a while, isn't it? I'm meeting up with one of my girlfriends out here for some desperately needed girl time. But hey, since you're here, maybe we can spend some quality time together too. <laughs> okay, Miss Jessie, you're all set. Here's your key. Uh, hello again. Do you two know each other? <laughs> I see you haven't lost your special sense of humor. You be careful around this guy, Leilani. If I know anything about him, it's that he's up to no good. Right. If there's something you want to ask me, don't be shy. 
Do you think I'm not going to say my boobs? <laughs> I mean, just look at them. Wow, you're actually looking at my face. <laughs> you must have something important to say. Country, for sure. You can take the girl out of the South, but you can't take the South out of the girl. Please don't hesitate to let me know if you have any questions. <laughs> I hope you don't think this is boring, but just plain old vanilla is fine for me. I'm not exactly the type to turn down a good time. Right then, let's go. Goldport, afternoon. Yes, I suppose it's never too late to learn how to play a new game. better. Way to treat a friend.
better now. Haven't lost your touch. There we go. That's it, baby. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, that was exactly the distraction I needed to take my mind off shit for a while. Thank you both very much for such a wonderful time. Is there anything I can get either of you? Is this girl not the cutest thing you've ever seen? Honey, you're off the clock. Relax. <laughs> I just want to ensure that our guests are completely satisfied with their stay. Satisfied, huh? In that case, I'm sure we can think of something for you to do. Now, there's one thing I never known about is that what two we gonna never even call that one. But never mind for cars to do that. You can't even resist it, that. I'm gonna go to the airport. Because why not? Hmm, I could swear there was a little coffee spot somewhere around here. Wait. Shit, now that I think about it, it might be on the other side of security. I'll just slip through the staff entrance real quick. In and out. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. I'm very sorry, but I don't think you're allowed to go that way. Oh, I'll buy it. Oh no, buy it. it's okay. I work for Tropica Airlines. I'm just gonna go grab a coffee. Oh, wow, uh, uh, ma'am, uh, you're gonna have to show me what's in your bra. <laughs> uh, uh, bags! Uh, I, I have to check your, your bags <laughs> for security purposes only. My bags? What are you talking about? I don't even have any bags. I, uh, I'm going to have to ask you to come with me for a b body inspection. Are you kidding me? This is absolutely ridiculous. S sorry, but it's uh, a policy. Yes, standard policy. <laughs> <sighs> All right, fine, whatever. Let's just get it over with, I guess. Ugh, is this really necessary? Hey, what are you? Where are you? Oh, oh my. Oh boy. Oh. Well, that was... <clears throat> uh, yeah, uh, everything, uh, everything checks out. <laughs> you're free to go on my face. Uh, wait, you're, you're, you're free to go on your way. <laughs> Dude, you can do that? Shit, I'm in the wrong line of work. Is this chick gonna be okay? She looks like she's about to pop an ovary. I hate to say oh, it, but you that. might not want to turn her on any more than she already is. As much as I'd like to see her make the floor all slippery, we need her to save that energy for dates. Try to distract her by talking about... I don't know. What's a thing that isn't sex? Yeah, it's really uh, hot and wet. <laughs> Yeah, never mind. It's hopeless. Huh? huh? Oh, sorry. Were you saying something? I was a little uh, lost in thought. <laughs> yes, this is a great job. I'm still getting used to the rules, though. <laughs> I got in trouble yesterday for performing too many uh, searches. <laughs> I'm really still quite new here. It's only been a month since I... Well, uh, since I left my home country. No, it's nothing like that. It's just uh, the people in my country, they're very old-fashioned. But I suppose none of that matters anymore. I live here now, on this beautiful island, where there are lots of beautiful girls wearing b b bikinis and uh, having <laughs> lotion on themselves. <laughs> God damn it! Now I'm horny too! Uh, I guess I'll go crank this one out. Oh! 
Oh no! Hey! So, officer, no since anymore. we've basically been to second base, to do I at least get to know your name? Oh, right, of course! My name is Labia. Uh, I mean, Abia! Abia! Uh, sorry! What do you. Uh, oh, sorry! Were you going to say something? I can't seem to stop going on roller coasters. I, uh, I like the way it shakes and bounces around. <laughs> you can put me down for that, too. Forgive my curiosity, but what are you thinking about right now? Yeah, round ones, soft ones. Perky ones, squishy ones. Mm. <laughs> you know what I've always wondered about you? What would you do if you found out you only had one month to live? Oh, get out of here. You expect me to believe that? Hmm. I may have underestimated the cost of vacationing. Things really add up quick. I'm gonna have to try to move twice as much inventory next month to make up for it. Hey! Do I look like the kind of person who would take a handout? This woman makes her own money and pays for her own things, thank you very much. there was something else I wanted to mention to you. The more you get to know these girls, the more they'll start to trust you and open up to you. On the upside, this means you'll be able to raise their affection levels even higher. But on the downside, it also means you're gonna find out about the baggage they carry. It could be something from their past, negative personality traits, or even medical issues. Unfortunately, Baggage will present new twists and challenges that you'll have to overcome. So, you'll want to familiarize yourself with the effect that each baggage will have on your date. If there's anything I've learned, it's to never turn down a potential opportunity. I knew you could plan a romantic date, but this is really something else. Appreciate your patience. Yes! Yeah. 
We're almost there. And there we go. Wow, zero moves. I really need to remember to get out and enjoy myself more often. You know, Abia, I don't think we ever quite finished that strip search. Huh? What? What? What do you mean? Mm, I can think of a couple sensitive areas you haven't investigated yet. <laughs> Gee, run in the door. girls with amazing bodies come to the resort. I know I shouldn't feel this way, but it does make me jealous. I wish I was as pretty as they are. Don't say that! I think you're very handsome! Me, on the other hand... Hey, my boobs are small, kill. I have no butt, my eyes look weird... I have no butt. And don't even get me started on my ugly nose. I don't know. I suppose I should feel lucky just to have what I have. Sometimes my friends say I'm annoying, but I'm not! You don't think I'm annoying, do you? I don't know! Probably because they're just being mean to me. I'm not annoying! I'm not, I'm not, I'm I'm all ears. I'm normally so pooped out by the time Friday night rolls around that I just kind of go to bed early. It might be against policy to go out with customers, but I think we can make an exception. On Friday night, Funkin'. Oh! Oh! 
Oh, you reserved hey, the royal suite? The cat what, uh, <laughs> what did you have in mind? Jeez, okay. I don't need to spoil anything. Jeez, okay. Uh, I'm too pooped to do anything. Was it turned on? No, it's still here. Okay, the same. And my TV is gonna turn off automatically. So, uh, it's like there it is. You know, for any reasons. Here, let me help! I'm a 
okay now. I didn't mean what I said before. Uh, well done. There we go. No, I'll get this one to her. Like causing and not even much more. I should probably be getting back to the hotel now. Oh. Uh, I feel so lucky to be able to wake up in this beautiful... I'm not used to people asking me about my opinion. Um, d do we have to say it out loud? You know, my b button, my flower, the happy spot. <sighs> there must be something you don't know about me yet. If you ask me, there's nothing quite as refreshing as a pint of mint chocolate chip. What can I do for you? I usually watch solo girls. There's something so sexy about a girl that can take care of herself like that. Um, I know this is a little out of the blue, but I just want to say thank you for spending time with me and taking me out and being so nice to me. I'm not used to getting this kind of attention. It's really more than I deserve. <laughs> And for making me laugh, too. Please don't misunderstand. I really appreciate everything. It just... It feels like I'm being selfish. <laughs> I don't want to hog you all to myself. Don't forget to pay attention to others, too, okay? Alright, then. My family would never approve of me dating. But, well, they're not here. I hope I don't have any oh. embarrassing accidents again. <gasps> I'm working up a bit of a sweat here. could handle that. the benches for a minute. Time to 
get back in the game. I need to work on my stamina. Should have gotten me? coffee earlier. Uh, thank you. My second wind. <sighs> I'm working up a bit of a sweat here. Did you manage to do better in an airplane bathroom? It's such a lovely day today, isn't it? The sun feels so nice. You know, I've always wanted to ask you something. Sometimes I wonder. Would I have been better off if I chose not to have my daughter? Well, thanks. But I'm not exactly sure how that helps, hon. Would you mind if I asked you a question? Do you have an embarrassing secret that you've never told anyone? Hmm. Yes, I suppose you're probably right. Is there something I can help you with? I love to go hiking when I get a day off. The island has so many beautiful views from the hilltops. 
I was hoping this vacation would distract me from everything going on at home. Don't get me wrong, I'm having a great time and everything. But I can't seem to take my mind off. Well, I don't want to bother you with my problems. <laughs> I know it shouldn't, but that actually does make me feel a little bit better. As long as you two sexy beasts are going, you can count me in. I'm actually oh. pretty good at okay. golf, you know. Don't it's worry. one of my I many don't hidden don't talents. Don't worry, though. <laughs> don't worry, though. Shit from you too. I didn't know it was the purple one. Fuck. I already like you so much. Oh, you go ahead. I don't want to slow you two down. Haven't lost your touch. What a guy. So much for that enjoyable vacation. Ugh, where is this chick? Late again as usual. Hi there, Nora. Shh. Is 
Jesus, are you stupid? How many times I gotta tell you to be quiet? Shoot! Sorry, I forgot again. Ugh, whatever, here's your shit. Yay! <laughs> Ugh, I give up. By the way, who's that guy over there watching us? What? Shit! Run! Nora! Where are you going? Whoa! Who is this angel? She's like an 11. No, a 12? Fuck. This is the kind of chick that's so hot, you almost wouldn't mind getting the hurt from her, you know? Like, this bitch is so hot, I would pay her just to spit in my face. I would suck her knees. I would chug a two liter of her genital juice like I was a competitive fucking eater. Hi there, handsome. You just gonna stand there? Or are you gonna come talk to me? <laughs> That's okay. I forget words all the time. Especially them big fancy ones. She's dumb too? Bro, I can't. I think I'm in love. My name's Candace. I'm a dancer at the strip club. You should come and visit me. Candace. Yay! <laughs> Aww, but wait. I don't think I'm working tonight. Shoot. If you want, I'll blow you behind that building for 20 bucks. Well, so much for these panties. I'm gonna go change. Nobody have sex while I'm gone. Dinner? Oh, how would you want to buy me dinner first, silly? Oh shit, okay, it's just you. Sorry to run off like that, but yo, you scared the shit out of me. Hi, Genora. Yeah, hi, Candice. Same time next week. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what are you gonna ask me? Wait, no. It's my turn. Can you guess how many times I've been pregnant? Nope. <laughs> That's a good guess, though. Okay, be honest with me, will ya? Is there anything that, like, keeps you up at night? I had a feeling you were gonna say some weird-ass shit like that. Save me a fuck ton of money on new shoes. Well, I'm gonna have to owe you a special favor. <laughs> You're goddamn right I want a fucking smoothie. I usually get paid for dating, but I can do a freebie for ya. Okay. <laughs> We're getting over a heart. Too hard. 
never mind the coverage. It's uncensored time. It's my pleasure to sexy night night to fight you. Bring on! Oh shit! Man, it's getting a little hot in here. But jeez, you been getting some cool as shit. <laughs> Where's my fucking energy right now? Sorry. <laughs> I can't stand this! <laughs> I know you want me. Jesus Christ! Cover your eyes, man! <laughs> Unless you're 18, you want it. <laughs> Not sure what happened back there. I never saw what happened. It's only just the beginning. I ain't even trying to fuck with that mess right now. You gotta be playing with me on that one. Oh, wait. Okay, I can have this.
that. I don't get it. Weren't you trying not to do that? Came to see me off, huh? How sweet. You're a real Romeo. Wish I could have stayed longer, but duty calls. See you when I see ya. <laughs> nah, I'm just fucking with ya. I'm actually waiting for my little cousin to arrive. When my aunt heard I was gonna be out of town for a while, she begged me to take her off her hands. I figured, sure, why not? I'm sure my aunt could use the break. My cousin can be... Uh, a handful. Speak of the devil, there she is! Hey Lil! Over here! Good to see you, cuz. Oh. How was the flight? Um, like, literally the worst experience of my entire fucking life? You say that about everything. Lighten up a little. You're in a tropical paradise. Whatever. I didn't ask to come here. My mom forced me to come because she fucking hates me. <laughs> Lillian, your mom does not hate you. I wish the plane would have crashed. Maybe then she'd finally be happy. All right, drama queen. Calm down, calm down. It'll be fun. You'll see. Before we do anything though, is there a bathroom around here? I gotta pee. Hey, sweet cheeks, entertain my cousin for a minute, will ya? I'll be right back. Oh great! Now we're stuck babysitting Count Snatula. Didn't the goth thing go out of style like six million years ago? I don't know, man. The dark priestess here is looking a little fresh, if you know what I mean. You might want to try to find out how old she is. <laughs> like I'm gonna waste my life sitting in a room learning about shit I'll never use. You don't need to babysit me, okay? I'm not a fucking kid, I'm 18! Phew, we're all clear for takeoff! Ugh, this is gonna be so boring. What is there even to do at this place? Without my computer tablet? Uh, yeah. I think I'd rather be dead, thanks. Maybe I'll just get wasted and let a bunch of guys have their way with me. Do you think my parents would like that? <laughs> Smooth. <sighs> Looks like Ash is finally done. That only took my okay. entire life. I call next dibs! I've been holding it for like 30 minutes. Well, don't raise Okay, the I'm back. Sorry for the wait. I hope she wasn't too much of a hassle for ya. Uh, can we go now? I'm hungry. In a minute, Lil. They haven't even started returning people's luggage yet. <sighs> Please kill me. Oh, that Sorry, I have a reputation to keep up. I can't be seen wearing those. Okay, what about her? Yeah, I think I'd rather be dead than...
If it wasn't for this kind of food, I'd definitely be gone. By now. Hey! You gonna feed it to me too? <laughs> Ask me anything. I got nothing to hide. Bro, I'm kind of disappointed you don't remember. I guess I'll give you a hint. It's 60 plus 10 minus 1. Um, like, <laughs> fucking hell yes! I guess I'm supposed to, like, ask you something. Okay. Would you rather be a vampire, a ghost, or a werewolf? That's cool, I guess. Chuck this faster than you! want that short as fuck, so I need someone tall. You have to be at least a foot taller than me. I wonder how stupid your answer will be to this. Do you have any piercings? <laughs> well, I guess I'll just have to, like, find it myself then, huh? I mean, if you guys are going, I'm not gonna stay here by myself. Okay, this place looks like uh -huh. that's it all I might knew. Be cool. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's all I knew about the uh, That's all I know about the outfit. That's all I know about the outfit. I don't think that's it. Stop our eating this day thing. Well, actually, it's kind of the first time. I think we do want to do But, never mind. We'll, we'll get to the store. So, uh... Yeah. 
that's not cool. I'm just gonna, like, lay on the ground for a minute. You do that again. Don't get cocky! Like, keep going or whatever? <laughs> what the actual fuck is wrong with you? Hey, it's the purple. I am over the significant ego. I really need to do more cardio. Oh, what? Oh, the stamina. What's it feel like to fall on your ass like that? I wouldn't know. Alright, we'll do that last one. Fuck, I didn't even see it. Another day, another dollar. Ask away, I get a kick out of answering your questions. New Year's Eve without a doubt. It's the perfect opportunity to take stock of life and hit the new year running. On that question, we are very like-minded. are pretty cute, but I just can't see myself wearing them. You brought me food? You... you don't need to do... That? I suppose it can't hurt to have a little bite. Or two. Now that's a refreshing beverage. Why don't you give that to another girl? I'm sure I've been trying to practice practice minimalism. I'm so quit goofing around. No, no, it's really nice, it is, but I don't... You deserve it. Why don't you give that to another girl? I'm sure she would love it. Sorry, but I can't. Be supporting this brand. I'm going to be competing with them someday.
What can I do for you? There's nothing like a good documentary. You can learn so much about a subject you've never even thought about before. We appear to be rather alike in our interests. What do you... Uh, oh, sorry. Were you going to say something? I can't seem to stop going on roller coasters. I, uh, I like the way it shakes and bounces around. <laughs> you can put me down for that, too. Think they have Wi Fi here? I need to respond to a couple of emails. That's a good point. I just hope it's not password protected. Vacation is no excuse to start being a lazy bum, right? There's plenty I can do remotely. It's better than falling behind, even if it means I don't have quite as much time for recreation. I suppose I can squeeze a little bit of fun into my schedule. Oh, back to this one. Well, here we This is just now. what I needed. My shoulders have been tight for days now. I thought I could handle that. By, doesn't it? Check my email real quick. Okay. Oh, oh, 
almost there. We are at seven moves. Wow. It just brought me everything. Is this the bonus round? Or... Since we've already been to second base, how about we take it all the way home? <laughs> oh wait, wait, bonus, bonus, oh! I never know that until they see that! Now that was a no, very was a throughout discussion. investigation. But I just succeeded in one! <laughs> just d doing it's my job! Mando. Mando, like... It's 818, alright? Jesus! Nice! It's Definitely depositing okay? that in it's the spank not bank. That bad. And Not look! Kids, we got our first pair of fairy wings! The system right. works! Come on! We'll it's need a like lot more than that to awaken the Nymphogen, though. So, so keep doing what you're like doing, like man! So Make Mama Sugar Dust proud! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! It won't get to you a lot too soon. I should have never tried that! Alright, now let's go to a hotel. Because Jesus Christ! I'm going to love reading sexual ideas. If you're having trouble, try feeding these chicks before your date. Bitches love to eat. I know that. Let me do five. I'll take that. Right then. That was the obvious game. So hope you like this video. Hit that link in the comments below. Subscribe to Powerful Night Night Free Five here. And I'll see you in the next video. Well that's always I'm freaking over the Master Max is his. Thank you, your effort there is stuff. And this is all I can cover now on. But thanks for watching. You were lucky to see them, alright? You were lucky to see them. Doesn't stand out count as well. I hope it didn't. I hope it didn't. Oh, it didn't. Oh, it well, well, uh, it's just a game. It's just a game. It's just a game. So, well, wait. Well, take it away.